spontaneous generation. Science doesn't believe things rather it theorizes. Therefore, majority of the last two millennia all scientific assumptions or beliefs replaced with better explanations. Spontaneous generation is one of those superseded theories that explain the living creatures could appear from non-living matter such as fleas could be made out of dust and maggots from dead flesh. Aristotle's explanations about spontaneous generation which he inherited from ancient philosophers favor this theory to be accepted way of how organisms appeared until the 1600s. Biologist Francesco Redi who is the founder of the experimental biology was the first scientist that challenged the spontaneous generation by experiments that the maggots came from the eggs of flies. Was Francesco successful? Him and other biologists tried their best but they couldn't convince people until the 19th century. Pasteur and other biologists were able to disprove the traditional theory of spontaneous generation and it was no longer controversial among biologists. Certainly, this moved the attention to the origin of life question. We are still debating on this in 21st century. However, biologists favor the belief that we might come from single form of life about 4 billion years ago.